Optimus, I've pinpointed the location of Megatron's space bridge. High in Earth's orbit. Out of our reach. Since Megatron is likely already in transit, I'm afraid we must take that risk. Reaching the space bridge first is our only means of stopping him. Hey, guess who's back? Autobot, prepare for departure. If you leave me stranded on a planet teeming with humans, I will never forgive you. Until we meet again, old friend. Autobots, roll out! Maximum overdrive! Autobots, transform and gravitize! Look down. Or up. Or left. So Megatron's packing enough dark energon to raise Cybertron's dead? And since we don't possess ready means of disabling the space bridge, nothing gets in or out. Well, what are they waiting for? It appears the Decepticons have sustained serious damage to their interstellar navigation system. Huh, that's my handiwork. Great job, Bulkhead. Without the dish, Megatron will be unable to aim the space bridge at Cybertron. If Megatron went to the trouble of rendezvousing with his space bridge, he must have an alternate targeting system. A remote one. Hmm. From what I know of Earth's technology, I doubt there exists a single radio telescope dish on this planet powerful enough to pinpoint Cybertron. What about a whole bunch of... This is not child's play. Good thinking, Raph. Ratchet, have Agent Fowler alert the array staff to the security hazard. You, soldier! You're out of uniform! Put on some pants! That may be a challenge. Wait, 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 Raph, what if we could get you all the way in? Like, inside the building in? I could log into their internal network on the other side of the firewall. The risk is too great. The Decepticons will be there. Perhaps even on site. Optimus, with all due respect, you said it yourself. This is bigger than the safety of three humans. Yeah! If we let the cons win... Raph? I want to give it a shot. <laughs> what just happened? The Decepticons are locking on to Cybertron. Indeed, Bumblebee. This can only be Raph's doing. So, how do we beat a whole planet of the undead? Optimus! I'm registering a rapidly expanding mass in their space bridge vortex, one with a peculiar energy signature. Dark energon. Ratchet, we must destroy the space bridge. There's enough live energon coursing through it to achieve detonation, but we lack the firepower to ignite it. Optimus, I must say, the space bridge is our sole hope of ever returning to Cybertron. Are you certain its destruction is the only option? I am afraid so. Then by all means, let us light our darkest hour. Autobots, take your positions and follow Ratchet's lead. 
while I make my stand. Your fellow Autobots are wise, Optimus. They know when to retreat. I hold no illusions about engaging your army, Megatron. But I might derail its objective by removing its head. <laughs> Highly unlikely, Optimus, as I am infused with their very might! One shall stand, one shall fall. I do not wish to question your all-seeing wisdom, but I believe the Autobots are up to something again. Beneath your bridge this time. Ah, misdirection, Optimus. You would have made a fine Decepticon. I chose my side. <laughs> The ground bridge is ready and waiting. Autobots, jump! Four life signals. One very faint. We lost one this week. By the AllSpark, don't let it be two. And Megatron? Not even he could have survived Ground Zero. So, is this the part where you say goodbye and tell us we need to forget we ever saw you? Without a means of leaving this world, we Autobots take strength in the bonds we have forged with our three young friends. True warriors. If not in body, then in spirit. My name is Optimus Prime, and I send this message. Though we did not choose to be of Earth, it would seem that we are here to stay. If you approach this planet with hostile intent, know this. We will defend ourselves. We will defend humanity. We will defend our home.